To get more FPS on CS2, what you need to do is come across to the Steam store, click search and type in lossless scaling. This is a new app which has just been released that will allow you to get more FPS. This is a paid app, so you will need to pay for it, but I'm going to go ahead and do that now. If you also want to increase your Steam level, then go down below and check out Duobot. Duobot allows you to level up your Steam account in seconds. Just use my link down below in the description, go across to the website, choose your dream level, and then level up. Leveling up your Steam account allows you to get more friends, allows for more trading cards to drop while you're in games, and much, much more. Check out Duobot down below in the description. Once you've paid for it, we're going to go to library, and then we're going to go ahead and search for it in our library. As you can see here, lots of scaling. I'm going to click install. I'm going to choose where I want to install it, and then I'm going to let the install download onto my PC. As you can see, it's downloading now. It's a very small app, so it shouldn't take too long at all. As you can see, mine has already finished. And as soon as that has downloaded, you're going to go ahead and open it up. Then go ahead and launch CS2. You don't need to do anything in the app yet. I'm going to show you a comparison between the two. So at the moment, you can see I'm getting about 180 FPS in CS2. So we're now going to go ahead and configure our lossless scaling. And I'm going to show you how this increases. Then what you need to do is choose LSFG 3.1 choose fixed from this option and then on the multiplier put this to three this is going to give you a nice balance between fps and scaling drawbacks then make sure capture api is set to dxgi and then you want to click scale now when you click scale it's going to give you a countdown in that countdown you need to make sure that you select and go back to cs2 so i'm going to click scale then go back to CS2, and as you can see, we're getting 180 FPS at the moment. We're going to give it a second. Now, because I've activated this, you guys can't see my FPS counter, but I'm now getting 250 FPS. More than 100 more FPS, guys, compared to what I was getting before. So I'd recommend checking these out. More FPS on CS2.